So what you can also do is you can change around your performance settings inside of CapCut Desktop Editor. So to do that, you need to go around under Menu and then go under Settings right here. So once you do that, over here, you can see that Performance tab is an option over here. So now you can see that you can change around the encoding settings, which helps you to speed up hardware um, uh, encoding and decoding. And turning this off may uh, actually hamper the speed of your workflow. That is because the um, optimization will be disabled. Apart from that, you can also go around and uh, enable uh, inter uh, interface render with GPU, which utilizes your graphic uh, card if you have uh, a compatible graphic card to speed up your workflow while you're editing footages. Apart from that, you can work around with proxy, uh, which are temporary uh, footages that is uh, more optimized for editing. And you can turn this on to speed up your workflow as well. The proxy location, however, is disabled as you can see right here. Uh, which you need to go around onto the home page when the project is closed so that you can set it. And over here, you can see proxy size is currently zero. That is because well, we don't have any proxy currently. But if you want to delete out the uh, proxy to save this space, then you can press on the delete button right here. Let me just say, uh, uh, hit save right here and then go around back onto home page right here. And once I do that, I can go around onto the settings and here under performance, you can see that now I can go around and choose a folder. So I'm just going to go around over here and then let's just select out a folder called projects right here and select out the folder. And once I do that, the proxy will be saved right here, just like this. So that is how you can go around and change around the performance settings inside of CapCut Desktop Editor. So I hope you guys learn something as always. And as always, please like, comment, share, and subscribe.